National Acrobat off the Black Sabbath Bloody Sabbath album by Black Sabbath. Okay, it's tuned down one and a half steps, and I, the reason why Tony did this is because he had prosthetic tips for fingers. So to release the tension, he would um, tune his guitar one and a half steps down, and that's how you got that evil Black Sabbath uh, riff master um, that that just wrote legendary. I mean, launched a thousand riffs that just murdered every single riff that ever came after that. You know, and, and did a lot of uh, influencing. So um, we're gonna start out with the fifth string, fifth fret, hammer on. Okay. Now you can, if you want to, you can play it on the fourth string, open. That's the beauty of guitar, is you can choose, make your own choices. Okay, some people will say, uh, no, no, you gotta play, oh, no, 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 you gotta play it. You gotta play it on the fifth string, fifth fret, but, I mean, you know, it's your choice. Okay, it's your freedom to, to do whatever you want, it's the same goddamn notes. Okay, so I'm gonna show you on the fifth string, which I found easier for myself, more control over the, the notes, okay? So, uh, it's fifth string, fifth fret to seventh fret, hammer on. Vibrato. Okay, hammer on twice. To a fifth string, uh, fifth, fourth string, fifth fret to fourth fret, vibrato. And just follow that, the tabs below on how many times you do it. Okay, so it's gonna be fifth string, fifth fret to the seventh fret four times. To a uh, fourth string ninth to seventh fret slide. Okay, another beauty moment on the guitar, whether if you want to do this or not yourself, you can actually bend it instead of sliding. Whatever you want to do, okay, whatever's easiest for you. Um, I, it sounds more like on the record that they uh, slide it. Okay, to a fifth string, fifth fret, vibrato, sixth string, fifth fret, and jump over to the fourth string, fourth to fifth fret, and then a fourth to fifth fret, hammer on, pull off, tremolo, which is just uh, basically hammer on and pulling off as fast as you can, okay? So let's go over it. Um, dead slow, okay? Now let's play it at normal speed, okay? It's a little faster. All right, now there's gonna be the verse, okay, which is just chords, and um, I'll just show you the position, tell you the number position, because since it's one and a half steps down, the open is like a C sharp, okay, which normally would be an E, but uh, to not confuse you, what I'm going to do is just uh, tell you the numbered frets, okay? It's going to be an open power chord for the for the verse, okay, when, when Ozzy comes in. To a third fret, six string position, power chord position. To, um, let's see... Uh, 
fifth string, fifth fret power chord position. To the sixth string, fifth fret power chord position. Okay, and I think there's certain strumming patterns in there. Just listen for it, but I'm just showing you the position, okay? One more time. Now the chorus is going to be third string, um, fifth fret, power chord, one over to the second, to the third on the sixth, and then a whole fret up, oh, I'm sorry, two frets up, to the fifth uh, fret on the sixth string power chord, okay? I'll go over it. Let's hope you learn something from that.